Yo, what is up YouTube? My name is Aaron and today we are playing some Counter-Strike Global Offensive again, except this time it's not a public match. This is actually a private match and it's set up to be 2v2s. This is the most fun thing I have done in a very long time and it's actually brought out my love for Counter-Strike. I did not know I liked this game this much until I played 2v2s. It, there's just something about it. In general, I love playing 2v2s, whether it's Call of Duty, Counter-Strike, or any other game. I just think 2v's and 3v's are some of the most fun things that you can do because it's competitive. It's not just running out and getting kills. It's a different mindset. And although I'm not that good at Counter-Strike, I did take some of what I use whenever I play competitive Call of Duty and just added it into this game. Now, a lot of you die-hard Counter-Strike fans, they'd be like, whoa, 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 you can't do that. Don't mix Call of Duty with this game. No, I'm not mixing Call of Duty. I'm just understanding this is kind of like Search and Destroy. I get that. That this is That's what this is. Search and Destroy, whether you like it or not, I don't know which one came out first. I think it could be Search and Destroy to whatever this is called. Honestly, I have no idea, but no matter what game you play, 2v2s, and it has to be multiplayer, is set up in a way where either you follow, you tag along with someone, and this will help you out. Whether you're playing Call of Duty or Counter-Strike, if you want to know how to play and how to get good and like something that I had to learn whenever I was playing competitive in Black Ops 3, Advanced Warfare, any of those games, is that you can't split up. The logical thing to do is say, hey, one of you go A, one of you go B, or I'll go A, you go B, and we'll let each other know when someone comes up so you can come in and help. That might be the thing that you were thinking about doing, but it's not going to work in a degree unless that one person does pick up a clutch and just kills both people that doesn't really work if you trade kills no matter what type of trading of the kill it is whether it's you go out and die or you go and put shots in the other person you let your teammate fresh come up and put shots in them and they die that leaves you in a 2v1 2v1s are really hard to get out of especially if you play at the hip and like in this game, I think we went up from being 7-2. and two. We did not win this. Wait, I think we did win this game. We did win this game, actually. Yeah, we did win this game. And the, the game after that, I think it also got tied at 7-7 uh, seven and seven and we lost. But this game in particular, we did win. But I don't know. Maybe, I, I know, I'm going to get a lot of hate for comparing this game to anything like Call of Duty. But the wits are still there. Just... This isn't supposed to be a tutorial video. I'm just telling you, I'm having a great time in Counter-Strike. I know, I went on a rant there, and especially for what this video is not supposed to be about, but I found a new love for this game. I've said that before, but it's so fun. This is something that I see myself doing a lot of. And the problem is, is that other people don't like doing 2v2s that often. They're like, hey, let's go rank up or something like that. I don't know if you can rank up in this. I don't think you can. I would assume not, but... If you guys do want to play some 2v2s, let me know. Let me know down below because this is really fun. Or 3v3s. But the point where it gets to like 6v6 or anything above 4, honestly, just kind of gets dry. I don't really like it because it's kind of like Publix. You just, in 2v2 and 3v3, you have to be tactical. And that's what I like. I like, even though I might not have the best gun skill... I like how I'm not just out of the fight, you know, there's not someone always checking something, you can always look where they're, they're not expecting you. That's really fun to me, I don't know, it, I could lose, I mean if I lose too much I'm going to get mad and not play, but it's fun. I like doing this, hopefully you guys enjoy this style of video where I'm just kind of like expressing myself to you guys, I don't know what it's called, but really good really good uh great teammates too played with some people from my school shout out to you guys if you're watching and i don't know just let me know if you guys want to see some more of these like 2v2 situations or 3v3s or more counter strike go i saw a lot with the games video i made asking you what i should play like you mainly i would say in a percentage at least 75 percent of people 
asked if I would play CSGO. So here it is. I know I'm stepping away from the zombies Call of Duty thing, but I'm not. This is just going to be filler until Der Isendraha comes out, or Der Isendrak comes out to Xbox One, and there's just going to be so much of that gameplay, and then hopefully I can get a PS4 by that time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It was really good. I think the video ends here with a kill or something. Maybe it doesn't end here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. My name's Aaron. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. Like this video if you liked it. Dislike it if you don't want me to play CSGO. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Peace.